Hi there, in this video I'm just going to quickly show you how to geocode, um, how to bulk geocode that is, uh, with a CSV file. Um, the, the, uh, and, and this is a question I've been asked by several people actually after my last, um, one of my previous videos about uh, searching to, um, searching, uh, navigating the map with place names and addresses and stuff. So this is where you can load a CSV file and, and geocode it basically. Um, well, plugins are your friend. So go to plugins, manage install plugins. And um, what you want to look for uh, is one called MMQGIS. So click on MMQGIS and you'll see that uh, th th this is a really powerful tool. And, um, and actually I just noticed it's uh, recently updated. Um, this, this is the author here, this is not my tool. Um, it, it's an exceptional tool, there's tons of stuff in it and I highly recommend it should be one of your sort of um, base plugins loaded. Um, so anyway, MMQGIS, install plugin. It shouldn't take long, there you go, press close. Okay, so I've got a little CSV file here, you see? So I've got the top here, city name, value and country. Um, I could have more detail on the left hand side uh, such as uh, address, for example, um, but uh, I've kept it fairly straightforward so you can easily see what's going to happen. What you can see is there looks like there's completely valid entries, London, Leicester, Nottingham, and Coventry, uh, but then this one, which um, to, to many will be a com completely valid entry, uh, but is certainly not the name of a city in the United Kingdom. So that's my CSV file, uh, and that's what I want to geocode automatically. When you install this MMQGIS plugin, you'll see the option Geocode. There's loads of other options. Have a play. I might do some videos on some others. But go to Geocode, and um, you can go sort of street by street sort of thing. But let, let, let's go to, to a city, just to a city centre. So I'm going to use the web service. My input uh, file, I'll just click on that and get my CSV. So it's Geocode list.csv. So that's in there. Uh, when I click on address, I don't actually have a full address, so I'm just going to leave that as none. It has picked up city name, I'll leave that. Uh, I don't not using the states, so that's empty, uh, but I will use country. So th this is the crux of it here, is the web service. You can get a free API from Google, just search for that. Um, and um, you can get a free uh, uh, free API, uh, because when you, when you have Google, you'll put your key in there, you see. Um, but I think there's a limit maybe per day for the for the free service. Um, I'm, I'm, um, I can't quite remember. Um, there might even be a limit for OpenStreetMap actually. I'll have to check that. But anyway, you'll you'll soon find out. So there's a few others, but uh, we'll just go for OpenStreetMap because there's, it's just open, no API. Uh, just use the first result that you come across, and um, what we can do is let's say we're successful. Let's have geocoded not successful let's have not geocoded so in there should just be the, the failed one record so that, that that's all you have to type press apply so I've only got a few records in here it shouldn't take too long but it but it will add uh, to it and there you see so it says geocoded four of five and that's what I expected press close and sure enough one two three four you can see those clearly um, let's just click on that that's the dot for London and um, there's city name, there it is, country, etc. There's a dot for commentary, that's all worked fine, so that's great. And then uh, if I look at my um, not geocoded file, here we go. So this is the not geocoded file, so it just has that one um, entry uh, as expected. So there you go, I hope that's, um, that helps. So it's just get the plugin, MMQGIS, does tons of other stuff. But it also geocodes uh, CSV with um, columns at the top, comma separated, of course, and uh, with it with a free service, OpenStreetMap, or um, you can use Google, etc. So uh, there you have it, bulk geocoding. Thank you.